as stakeholders knows how important this project is and as far as the development of our country and our areas are concerned. However, you know, in Wachiso, in as far as matters of land are concerned, <laughs> they are very complicated. <laughs> Two, we need the smoothness and the harmonious way of implementing this project. Is a, what would I call it? Center, a master kit project, not only for Wakiso, but Kampala and the whole country. country. Mm -hmm. Because when you look at, one time I was even telling cases <laughs> So if we can improve this infrastructure, this network, it's going to be a game changer. A very big game changer in trade, in movement of persons. Every time when we are in cabinet, my, my fellow ministers have been quarreling. Why can't I move from, you know the jam, mwenamu jumanyi jam, okuwa wali echengera, nenga tunatuka na chengera, ensanji, okutuka. It is very, but the road was bad. So I, it, I, this is a very big project. It's a, pro, a project which is in the, have been in the National Development Plan 3, but we are delayed to implement because of money. As we have heard, it's a government of Uganda, fully funded by government of Uganda. No money going to be borrowed. Both the compensation and also the money pay the contractor. It's fully government of Uganda. So it's your money. It's your money. It's your taxes. So you must make sure that you get value for money. Both even in terms of compensation that you don't compensate air. That you compensate the right people with the right amount of money as directed by the chief government value. So you must be interested in this project. Talk about development. It doesn't have to exclude anyone. It has a chinko zebulunji to a mayor to lean abo. Nashtag is anti way to one. Or limit to get Oko, get a rudy mu, to an angle good or Rutan, the Kakuanga, Fetchuka Katako, or Kravi get to get on the communities that fit when I'm Kilizabu Yoma way at Taka. Nayabo to Maroko get an Abonga, but now a kiss over Nadim PG, Naba and to Naba Kwati Wakova Kiliza. While Rumu Mubeda Maba to whatever Sula Wachi Tundu, Nayanga Tabiba owning a Takaid. So to gain the to labour thing, to fund our budget, as a minister, I will really request that let's have one uniform, one uniform voice. But talk about development; it doesn't have to exclude anyone. It has a chinko zebulunji to a mayor to lean abo. Ngashite gezanti we tova ano. Oli metro gani oko gela ruri dumu to an angle ruri gudo ruta andi kakuba anga fechi tu kaka tako. Okula begeje tu gela ne communities zafet to an angle mukiri zebuli yomwa we yetaka. Na yebo tu malo oko gela na bonga ba na waki sova na mpiji na ba antu bo na ba kuati wa kuba kiri za. Kwa rumu mubera mwa ba antu ngateba sula bwe chichi tu ndu na yenga ateba owning etake edu. So to gain the to labour thing that to fund our budget, as a minister, I will really request that let's have one uniform, one uniform voice. But yeah, with that one uniform voice, when it's really to the point, say that when we talk that Nakauka Road is going to commence, the people of Umpija again do not say something different, which is not to the which is to the contrary. But also, whatever we talk, it should be the same. But as it as it is the same, let it be that it is the real. There is no way now for us as leaders, we can be comfortable when the people of Sentem are looking at us, whereas we don't have any more words to tell them. Now the people of Nakauka will also look at us. So as we commit ourselves to talk to the communities, because mayors, it's now going to be up to you to see how best we shall have those meetings, to gather with us MPs, to convince the communities that the project is on. As you know, I am chairing Kosasi, and the EP knows. So, so for that reason, for that reason, not only accountability but also influence is of the essence. That was on a light note, Mr. Honourable Minister. By government of Uganda, through the taxpayer, so there is no donor funding, and the project comprises of five links, totaling to seventy-two point five kilometers. And much of it is in works district, and part of it in PG. The links are Kisubi Nakauka Nadete, which takes 27 kilometers, Nakauka Kasanje 
PG. No, the other is 27 kilometers. Nakauka, Kasanya, and PG is 22. Then Nakauka, Mawaguru, Nanzga, Maya, 11 kilometers. It's Kasanya, Waya, which is 9 kilometers. And then the section of Entebbe, Nachugo, 3.5 kilometers. The Kasanya, Waya, will connect Entebbe, Nachugo through the ferry that crosses that part of the Victoria. For us, the ferry is a continuation of the road, so it's part of our road. Uh, there is a section at Kassan towards the Masaka Road. Originally, it was supposed to be just going to the road, Masaka Road, but we want to rearrange it so that it fits within the Sagapid Expressway. So there is a seamless flow. It should go into the interchange, so that if you are from Entebbe, you can even go to Mitiana without passing through Masaka Road and turning around. So that one section will be rearranged. Uh, the objective is basically is to improve traffic flow and connectivity within and around Wakiso, Kampara, and Mpiji district, using transport, reducing travel costs, and basically to improve the quality of national road network within the central region and other areas, thereby improving social economic development whereby services are reduced, especially in transport and vehicle maintenance costs within the region. But while we are doing this, we shall ensure we are not endangering the communities along the road project. The road should be good for them, should bring development instead of killing them. That's our major concern. That's why we always manage social and environmental issues, which are basically concerning the people along the project corridor. There is a map, that one shows the location of the roads, links, where they are located within the central region. Now, this project, as I said, is funded by the government of Uganda, and is going to be implemented through UNRWA, half of government. The contractor who has secured this project is Kodrosi, those people who have produced themselves, China Construction, Communication Company Limited, CCCC. Um, the contract was awarded and the commencement was given last month on 15 September. It is costing 340 billion and is supposed to be completed within 36 months, three years. That is December 2026. The whole project should be complete. After that, the contractor will still remain liable for two years at his own cost. In the case of anything that happens as a defect on the road, he must attend to it at his own cost. That's what we call the defect liability period. Is there also a consultant who is supposed to provide this project? Uh, the contract is not yet signed, that has been cleared by the Solicitor General. We are now preparing the signature. I think by next week I should sign that contract also. And it's also going to take 4.5 billion to supervise the whole works. I, we also have a district board on the project. That one is also a requirement in the contract. In the case the contractor and the employer or government don't agree on some matter, there must be somebody to be So that district board is always a requirement. And you're also going to be there. We also have a company of a nominated service provider whose responsibility is to give services related to AIDS, HIV, gender, child protection, and other social services that may be affecting the people. You Nobody know, comes, comes with some problems. We have had some girls being raped here and there. Many, many problems. So, there must be somebody who will be raising the community full time, sensitizing the community and appealing to those issues. Yeah, the scope, this is a normal road, there's nothing new. It's going to be a tarmac road paved with asphalt. And it will be 11 meter wide, 
Step in, carry you and the two meters each side for the shoulders. The shoulders, that's where the vehicles not, they are not supposed to pass, although sometimes they pass. <laughs> that's for parking, in case the vehicle has got an accident, you can park there, and somebody is passing along the highway. This is not a town road. You can't have walkways. So sometimes these shoulders work as walkways. If somebody is on the highway, you can use the shoulder. Then the carriageway, the standard one of seven meters for the two lanes. Uh, we have an issue of land. That's why we shall need your support. We have started acquiring land. We have not paid, but we have secured the fund this quarter. The funds that are coming this quarter release. We shall start paying those people we have called for disclosure. The area as well, we have asked you to submit your documents, land titles, IDs, bank statements. When the release comes now, we shall start paying you. Others, the process are ongoing. This one we shall request, I think even the minister will advise this one, the local leaders to assist us in getting land. It's a very serious problem. This, because when you don't get the land, the road that works will not move, and the contractor will be charging us for not working. For him, is this in carefully. Sometimes a non-serious contractor will pay that there is no land, but he starts earning the free money. But we always want to have land. So what we do, we shall be coming to you to request you to engage the Wanainchi so they can, those who can wait can give us land as they wait, provided they are aware of what they are supposed to get and they have accepted.